Hey guys, hope you're doing well in these COVID-19 times. Today, I want to bring you guys a special episode. And that's actually me reacting to my first ever vlog that I posted on my YouTube channel. I still remember when I was in 11th grade, I was debating whether or not to do this vlog. And a lot of people actually asked me this question. Why did I become a vlogger in the first place? Well, one of the reasons is because I get so much adrenaline just holding out a camera in the public. And that actually boosts a lot of my confidence. So vlogging has been a wild ride for me. I appreciate everyone who watches my videos, even if it's just a few hundred views, but it's been good. Thanks so much. This was a trip that I went on with my team to Japan because we were fortunate enough to win the Japan Wizards competition during my junior year of high school. So let's get started. I can tell you it's been so long since that vlog that I'm really excited to watch it right now and see how I perform. Okay, so it's all the way back two years ago, I believe. So here are all my vlog videos from first year. And this is me in high school. Wow, I even made my own couscous tasty video. <laughs> okay, so I found my vlogging video. This is actually a summary of five days actually in Japan, starting with day one and two in Tokyo. What's up, guys? So let's go ahead and play it. I'm going to rate myself from one to ten, actually, after watching this video, both the editing and how I speak. Oh, man, I even got two dislikes. Guys, I'm getting hated on day one. <laughs> All right, let's get it, Vincent. Let's get it. What's up, guys? Welcome to day one of our adventure. What's up, in Japan. guys? Before I start the travel vlog, I would like to thank Jash or the Japan America Society of Hawaii for sponsoring this trip. There were a total of 126 students presented 25 high schools. Okay, I'm gonna stop the video right now and show you guys who my team members are. So on the top, we got Sherry. I circled her, and then we have Cody down there. And me, I'm on the very right. Oahu, Hawaii, Maui, and Kauai at the 14th Annual Japan Wizards Statewide Academic 240. Team Comp, scoring 240 points out of okay, 300 points hyper -labs. possible. Well, let's get on to our venture, shall we? Let's get on to our venture, shall we? Oh, some Pokemon Go. We saw we found some Pokemon in Japan. Remember that all my videos that I took were on my iPhone 4. So it was like super old. But during that walkthrough, like this Nakano Broadway walkthrough, I was holding up my phone like this in the air and I was just recording the entire way. Okay, so we got some nice thumbnails here, but the truth behind this picture is that I actually use my crappy photoshopping skills and I put us into a random temple that I found on Google. So this hoggy picture, I cannot find any pictures out there. So I literally just photoshopped us into a random Google picture that I found on the internet. <laughs> and how you can tell is the side of my head is cut off while the side of Sherry's head is also cut off. What's up? Welcome to day four of our adventures in Japan. Here's the Lanai view from our suite. Temperature is really cool, but the scene is amazing. This is our suite. Has everything, TV, two beds. 
Okay, so for this scene, when we were driving in Yamaguchi, I honestly give myself so much props for this. And the reason why was because when Sensei was driving, Sensei is uh, the teacher, I was actually holding my iPhone 4S on the top like this for 15 minutes straight because I literally did not have any other vlogging gear. music up but we still have the same crooked cropped picture of a random background oh look at this so hard working what's up guys why are we working on my music let's get it guys you guys are not stop watching this what's up guys welcome to part two of our hoggy adventures i got so hyped for this man i really wanted to post this because this was my first vlog Got so hyped for this. Honestly, I'm proud of myself for taking that first step out. My first vlog was the hardest. Man, I had to step out of my comfort zone just to make this video. Props to you. I remember eating that ice cream. It felt so good. It was like an orange, creamy flavored ice cream. And that was also my first hyperlapse eating something. <laughs> so this lady at the grocery store, she was talking to me in Japanese. And I was taking Japanese in high school, but I didn't know like what she said whatsoever. So I just said, ohashi, and it just means like chopsticks. Like, do you have any chopsticks? That's how I survived in Japan. Literally just chopsticks and thank you. So we just got done meeting with the consulate general. She was really nice and all, but we couldn't record in there so I couldn't get any footage of that. Uh, me and the other guys split up. I'm going to round one, and Cody and Sherry, they're going to just check out Fukuoka and the museum. And then Sensei is going to the bookshop. So yeah, that's the plan. I literally threw so many frames, and I edited out all the ones that I didn't get a strike. And I only put the one with the strike in. So this video is probably the best throw I had in this round. Yeah. Beat me. It's not gonna happen. 
for this play. <laughs> like literally, of course. I think that was my other strike that I got on this adventure. That was my second strike. So luckily, I had two strikes in which I could feature in both times. Check out Vincent's videos every single day. Full videos and Japan vlogs. Love is simple, nana. Awesome. Okay. Let me give myself a rating first. I feel that I deserved, uh, let's see, I'd probably say an 8 out of 10. And the reason why I say that is because I got really good footage for my first time. I, I have to say it's not bad. All my angles were pretty decent. I was able to stabilize my videos and get some good graphics. And I also learned how to hyperlapse in that case. So I gave me a plus for that one. Something else that I could have worked on was my Photoshop skills. As you saw in many of my thumbnails, half of my head was almost cut off. And probably used better vlogging camera gear as well as editing softwares. But for my first time, I felt I did a pretty decent job. But since it's my first time, I'm actually pretty glad on how well I did. The transitions looked really good. Good job, 11th grade Vincent. Peace.